There's been another major shakeup in California's COVID-19 vaccine rollout. After a month of complaints that the system is too slow and too rocky, the state is now turning to a health insurance giant to lead the distribution. And in L.A. County tonight, there is talk of how soon some public schools could reopen. Kick on Leslie Marin has more tonight. My first thought was, why? And uh, my second thought was, well, we've actually been having trouble getting the vaccine effectively implemented. Like many Californians, Dr. Mike Wasserman, who sits on the state's vaccine advisory committee, is frustrated with the sluggish and confusing vaccine rollout. That vaccine was supposed to go to nursing homes, to assisted living facilities, to group homes, and we've been behind. But in a major move today, the governor's office announced health insurance giant Blue Shield of California will now create and manage the statewide vaccination system. The nonprofit would be in charge of allocating doses directly to providers, a job that up until now was left to county health agencies to figure out. Kaiser will also run a separate vaccination program for its providers. If this helps speed that up, then I'm all for it. When it comes to deaths, today LA County saw one of its deadliest days, 307 people, but hospitalizations and case rates are down. And today, Dr. Barbara Ferrer said if this trend continues, we could see other sectors like schools reopen. Continue to decrease, like we might hit that number in like two to three weeks. But not so fast, even if cases do decline, LAUSD and its teachers union have been adamant. They want all teachers and staff to be vaccinated before returning to the classroom. Mother Sonia Rivera agrees, despite the difficulties of virtual learning. She works at a hospital and sees the virus's impact. People, like, they don't even have symptoms and, you know, they are positive. And I'm afraid to bring my kids yeah. to school. But despite more reopenings, restaurants moving to outdoor dining by the end of the week. Tonight, health officials once again reminding people, especially as the Super Bowl draws near, this isn't the time to reverse all of our hard work. You can't be standing and eating and drinking. Uh, you can't be gathering in crowds. That's where transmission happened and will happen again. Leslie Marin, KCAL 9 News.